was saying, You've called me Lord and Master, and you've done well, for so I am. And if I be your Master and Lord, be willing to wash your feet, and you ought to wash one another's feet. For the servant is not greater than his Master, neither, neither is he that is sent greater than he that sendeth. Happy are you if you will do this one for another. You have to understand that the time is coming when you'll all be offended of me. All of you. It's okay. I'll not be alone. For the Father, he, he will always be with me. And then Peter leaps to his feet and says, But Master, I, I would not be offended of you. I would lay down my life for you. Would you, Peter? Peter, before the rooster crows, you're going to deny three times that you even know me. When I say I go to the Father, you don't understand, but if I go, I'll send the Holy Spirit, the Comforter. Without Him, you'll do nothing. I would like to say, just before I leave you, that I'll be back someday. With me, I'll take you. So don't be afraid. Watch and pray and wait for my return. I've done what I must do. My work is completed. It's all been done for you. Eat what I've stated. And I will give you peace through your tribulation. Till I come again Know that I I love you And I'll stand by your side Allow the Spirit To be your guide You'll not suffer long I'll suffer for you I love you With my life I go to prepare a place where we can be two. Together we'll see each other face to face. In that new forever. But don't let your love grow cold. For I will not allow more than you can bear. Know that I love you. And I'll stay by your side Allow the Spirit to be your guide You'll not suffer long Cause I'll suffer for you I love you with my life I love you with my life Jesus prayed that we would not be lost in all that we were to encounter. We followed him out through the starry night. The crowd was deafening. So many people around. And inside the temple, the lambs were being slaughtered. Before long, we made our way far enough out that the sound was where we could talk. This place is called Gethsemane.